My name is Tilly Sivanathan. I'm a fertility specialist and obstetrician gynaecologist, and I've been in practice uh, for over 10 years with uh, IVF Australia. I chose to become a fertility specialist because it's the uh, one area I was exposed to during training which was uh, thought was quite dynamic. There was a change that was uh, quite progressive in comparison to a lot of other areas that I've worked in. Uh, and that translated to improved patient outcomes in a short period of space of time. In terms of area of interest, I've got a fairly broad practice in fertility. I do reproductive surgery, I do I treat patients with polycystic ovary syndrome uh, who need medical management predominantly, and I also do uh, lots of IVF for those that need IVF, uh, including donor IVF. I would, I'd say the favorite, most favourite part of my job is um, when patients come back uh, for their early pregnancy ultrasound at seven weeks and you can demonstrate um, a pregnancy sac in the uterus with a beating heart and I think that's special. My approach to patient care is to as much as possible uh, inform patients about the evidence uh, that support the treatments that are available uh, so they're in the best position to try and make an informed choice um, about which way they'd like to go forward. There are lots of treatments available um, you know, which might be you know, recommended on the internet, for example. Um, and uh, all I would like to do is to just have a discussion uh, with the evidence that's available, so that patients can, uh, the patients are fully informed going forward with whatever method of treatment they choose to do. I like my patients to feel at ease when they see me. Um, uh, you know, what I would normally try and do at that first visit is to uh, try and as much as possible gain their trust because I think that's very important uh, going forward. Well, uh, when I'm not working, uh, I, I do have hobbies but I have no time to practice those hobbies because I have two young kids. <laughs> uh, they keep me occupied uh, every hour outside of my working life. My advice to patients is that uh, fertility, uh, infertility is very common, it affects one in six couples. What I'd recommend is um, if they've been trying for more than 12 months to conceive and the woman is under the age of 35 they should seek help. Uh, if the woman happens to be over 35, uh, six months of trying should be a cue for them to seek help uh, and they should see someone, be it a general practitioner or a fertility specialist and we can take things from there.